Hello everybody, in this video we'll take a look at how we can use Google Classroom Sync into Progress Book Gradebook. To get started here, we will start in our Progress Book in our Teacher Homepage. All we have to do is go into whichever classroom we want to, uh, to sync to. I'll just go into this German class here. Once we're in, um, first off, the biggest thing to note is on the left hand side here, we, of course, we have all of our students in our roster in, our, in this class. The one thing we have to make sure of is that the students that are in this roster here on the left hand side are the exact same students that we have in our Google Classroom. All right, as long as we have that, this will be totally fine. So, to get started, we will go and find the Google Classroom Sync button. Here it is, and we give it a click. Now we'll, we will choose an assignment type. For me, I created an assignment type, type called Google Classroom. Some schools may require teachers to only have a certain number or certain uh, types of assignment types. So of course, if you wanna use, a, use it as an in-class work or a test or a quiz, whatever your school tells you to do, go with. Then in the middle of the page, we will select which Google Classroom we are going to pull grades from. I'll pull this from my remote learning class. And now I'll, I will pick whichever assignment or assignments I want to sync. You will have to do this for each assignment. It's not going to automatically sync and every time a student turns something in in Google, in Google Classroom. You will have to do this uh, afterwards after they turn something in. A good method is to just turn, uh, go through your sync uh, like at the end of the week. All right, so we picked our assignments that we are going to sync and then we will click next in the top right. Now, all these names here that come up here, all these are, are giving, giving me specifically errors because all I have are these fake dummy student accounts here. For you, you actually have real students. They will show up as blue and you won't have this message over here on the side, okay? You will just have the students' names and it'll show the grade that the, that student got from Google Classroom. Then we'll click on sync up in the top right. And then that's it. We will see all the students' names and what mark that they got. These grades are then carried right over into your progress book gradebook. And that's all you have to do. Again, this is something you will have to do uh, on a regular basis. It's not something that will be done automatically for you uh, every time a student turns something in in Google Classroom. Again, a good rule of thumb is to go through this process like once a week. So I hope this video was helpful for you guys. I'll see you in the next one.